Hey everyone, Midnight Nova here, and today we're going to play some more Enshrouded. And so today we are going to go get the kettle for the farmer. It is way up to the north. So we're going to set Pike Mead's Reach as our waypoint. And then we also have some skill points to spend. Let's get our spirit. Attacking with a magic weapon, all damage increased by 10%. Unlock that one. Let's get the Necromancer. I love it. More spirit. Also good. So yeah, arsonist. And Iceman. There we go. Cool, cool. We spent all our points. And now we are powerful. I think we can go east from this flame sanctum here. And then go north. And then we shall go east. And... See if we can find that bridge that I was at earlier. And, uh... Try to go north from that bridge. Mmm, strawberries. Might as well get strawberries. Isn't there a path that leads towards the east? Like this way. All the paths are really, like, strangely, um, strangely structured, you know? They're never, like, direct towards where you want to go. You just gotta, uh, get on a path and hope it leads you in the right direction. <laughs> you got a lot more of this, uh, flax around here. This is a good spot to grab some if you wanted to get more of it. So yeah, this is definitely heading towards the east. We're in the shroud now. I'm gonna switch to my fire bolts just in case. And, um, there's more of those flowers there. So I can get some more of these, um, shroud sacks if I wanted. Not sure why I would need them, but I can get them. In case there is a use for them. So, let's see. I don't want to be in here. Probably want to head north if I can. So that's what this, that's where this goes, right? Poison sacks. We probably need those for something, too. I don't remember what now. <laughs> ah, here we go. Is this the, the bridge I was thinking of? Because this heads to the north. This just goes to the spire. So instead, we'll keep going east. If we can. Where does this go? South? Don't go south. And goes north, so we'll go east. We'll take this road and see if it leads us where we want to go. Maybe. I don't even know. Is this multiple directions? There you go. Okay, I mean, I don't know the most direct route to uh, where I want to go. We're just gonna go and hope, hopefully, 
We'll get there. I mean, that's... That's been my entire experience with this game so far, is just... I don't know how to get there. Hopefully, this is the right way. I remember that coming here before. There's a bunch of those types of plants. Um, like, yeah, so... Keep going this way. That works. Slowly. <laughs> Bad wolf. How dare you bite me? How dare you? Let's see, are we going? Well, we're still going in the right direction, I suppose. Um, am I hurting that thing or what? There you go. I'm trying to use my eternal spell. Yeah. Jerk! Jerk boar! Jerk boars! Could you die? Could you die though? This could be a problem. This could be a problem. I gotta like... Avoid this thing. While... Waiting for my magic to respawn. Come on! Come in! Okay. So yeah, certain types of magic are way more... Um... Effective than others. I mean... If you have enough distance, it doesn't matter. So I can use my eternal spell on things that are far away, but things that are close up might require fire. So we're heading in somewhat of the correct direction that I want to go. Um, let's do a um, bandage. I gotta remember to use my um, my mana potions. I haven't been doing that. In the middle of combat, I'm gonna want to do that. For sure. Yeah. Can I please? There's some copper here. Eh, we don't need that at the moment. I'm gonna get a strawberry. Yeah. This keeps going towards the east-ish. This. Is this a bridge? This might lead to where I want to go. It's a lot of strawberries, though. A lot of strawberries and chamomile. Hmm. Chamomile. Hmm. Is this a bridge? Can I... Can I go across this uh, gap here? Do I need to go through the shroud in order to get across this place? I might might have to um there might be a bridge here let's go back to the road
Is that a fortress over there? Maybe that can be used for um something. And I fly across from the top of that uh that fortress maybe. Mm hmm. So many strawberries. I hope the, the farmer can make us some of that strawberry wine she was talking about. Like, is that, um... Does that give us, like, a buff, or does that make us drunk and give us a debuff? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if this is the right path to go in, but... More... Boar! Boar! Bad boar. And... Did we run out of food and water already, too? <sighs> so, like... There's so many different paths. I'm not sure which one is the best one to take. If I should be taking the main roads or Fawn Song Frontier. Is this another, like, encampment? It doesn't seem like this goes all the way across. So I might want to just get back to that main road. This is like a, yeah, there's another matron there. I see. But I'm not sure if we want to fight a matron at the moment. So can we just keep going past? <laughs> and there's a berserker right there. Probably not wise to uh, go in there if you can avoid it. We're just gonna keep going. Take out that wolf. See if there's anything up this ladder. I don't know. Do -do 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 -do. Is there anything worth looting up here? Perhaps not. Okay. So, we'll just keep going. There's a road here, and it's leading... ...sort of in that direction. So I'm hoping there's an actual bridge that leads us across. I'm hoping. Some more clay. It's a ruined town, looks like. More of those mushroom guys. Do they drop any anything worth worth getting? Should I not have messed with that guy? Your uh, poison clouds last for a long time. Maybe I should just not mess with those guys if I can uh, ever avoid it. You know? 15! Wow. Doing 15 damage with my, uh, my magic staff is not great. That is very inefficient. Let's see here. Anything good in this little farm? Spider! Oh, I don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Oh boy. There's some skittering. 
Oh boy. Speaking of critter parts, ooh, lightning charges. I figured out how to make the goo. Um, goo re just requires grinding up critter parts. So, that's something that we could do eventually. In order to upgrade our flame, that is one option we could uh, employ is just Grinding up some critter parts, that'll get us some goo. And uh, then we can upgrade our flame later, I suppose, when we actually need to. Lockpick, not bad, not bad. Um. Hmm, is there anything in this building that's worth looting? I might want to uh, make a reference point. Get a marker. We'll make this like... Great, I don't know. As you can sleep here, potentially. Uh-oh. I did not swing all the way like I thought I was gonna. That's better. What happened there? I was getting stuck on something. Mm, fireplace. Anything in here? Some tar? Why would you keep that on your dresser? Anything in here? Oh, we can sleep in here. Good. That's what I thought. Yeah, there's a lock pick. Oh. How late is it in the day? Should I stick around here so I can go to bed? Might want to. actually take those <laughs> bandages are always good uh, nothing on here what about downstairs we got anything in here string is that twigs that's twigs <sighs> tub disease always taking out these people when will they ever learn String, water, Ooh, lock pick. Is this just an exit? That is just an exit, okay. Well, that's not how I came in. Now, it's definitely getting late in the day. Is there anything else here worth, like, looking into? Now, which way did we come in? Was it this way? This leads into some shroud? Is this where we want to go? Yeah, in order to cross this uh, valley, should we be going through the shroud here? Or should we try to be going, like... Is that a bridge? Maybe I'll try to go in that direction first. Yeah, I think we came in... from the other way. Uh-oh, pigs! Pigs! 
That pig's up war. That one is following me. What is that? Oh, that's a skull buddy. That's a skull bud. Is he going after that enemy over there? <laughs> Interesting. Skull friend. Okay. I was wondering what that uh, floating skull was all about. I'm like, oh yeah! I'm a necromancer now. What's up, my dude? You're not the uh, the skull of a boar, though. That's, that's kind of a little, that's a little, a little strange. Oh, and he poofed out of existence. Okay, cool, cool. <laughs> sure, sure. Yeah, it's almost dark. So I, I had better go to bed before I proceed. Excellent. Nice comfy bed. It's now morning. Still a little dark though. <laughs> we'll go ahead and eat. Drink some more water. And uh, we now we can see to get out of here. <laughs> Okay. Boar! No boar! No boar! I wish you would die faster. Sure wish you would die a little faster. Did that boar kill this deer looking thing? <laughs> Alright, so we want to go back to the main path that we were on and then head east some more I think oh, is this a flame altar hey while we're here flame altar flame sanctum here we go oh. got some posh got a respawn and we got some spark yes Yes. Like that one wood. <laughs> and one twig. Get a little spark. Two sparks. Very nice. And eh, we can smash some uh, ancient trash cans. Get some more loot. Copper bar. Wool. We're getting some better loot from this area here. This must be like a higher level area, so that it has better loot. Mm -hmm. Water. Okay. Is that all? Okay, that's all. Okay. Let's move on. And, um, yeah, head to the east, because we are still going. We want to go north of here. And we can go into this valley, but perhaps there is a bridge. I, th I thought I saw a bridge that uh, would lead across the valley. So, let's see if we can find that and take it. And eat a, eat a berry. There we go. Cool, cool. No, no, no mushes. No mushy men. Mushy boys. What is this? What is all this? Anything good? 
Um, oh, my backpack is full. I've been looting too much. I mean, we got one extra of those. We got enough of that. Hmm. That's probably fine. It's just a little... Fortress thing? Is there an entrance on the lower level? Ooh. Wisp light. What is this? Uh, fire. Water. Okay. This is just like a little guard station or something. Well, alrighty then. Keep going. Those games again. It's like a a former camp. I feel like this is the type of thing that might be in like a quest. Like come to this spot and dig or something. Hmm. Keep going. I still want to get to that wall. I think. Not a bore. Ah, oh, the boars. Man, boars are just the most annoying enemy in the game so far. I mean, so far. <laughs> What if there's a more annoying enemy later? Hmm. What if? So we can go south. What is this structure here? Is this like a little... scavenger place? Yeah, these guys are vulnerable to... Ice magic. Ow. Uh, bandage up. Got him. More boars over there. Anything up here? Anything inside? What do you got? Nobody inside, though? Catacombs. We've got some more catacombs. Is this uh, somewhere I should be? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I should leave here and come back later. Catacombs. Catacombs are always interesting. Do I want to go through here? Maybe I do. Oh, there's a wolf. There's a wolf in there. Get out of here. I don't know if I want to go in there. I might not want to. But I might have to. In order to get... To that uh wall there. Is this a red mist? This might be a red mist that will kill me. Yeah, sure looks like it. Sure looks like a red mist. Um, um, um. Deadly shroud. Deadly shroud. I can't go there until I upgrade my, uh, my flame. Um... So in that case... How does one? Should I go down into the... The shroud from here to get up to there? Possibly. 
More boars. No boars. Gonna need more fire charges soon. I'm gonna use them all up on just boars. Okay. Well, we can't go that direction. Um, so I can either try going to this catacomb, which might lead us to this top area and then it'll get us across, or I could go back and try to make it through this shroud here from this little farmstead. Let's just go back here, and then go down in the shroud. See what happens. See if we can remain alive long enough to get anything cool. So, we're gonna eat. We're gonna drink. We're gonna eat some more berry. And we're gonna see what we can do down here. Actually, Shroud Survival Flask. There we go. So here we are. We're we're in the valley, and we get across and get to our kettle. For goodness' sake! I want to. Ouch. No. Don't sit. You fool. This guy. Too fast. He's too fast. Die. Wow. Okay. Being a mage is not the best thing. It's a completely different playstyle, and you will often get rushed by berserker enemies. They just charge at you. And I'm not okay with that. And ice doesn't work on those guys very well, unfortunately. And we're down to 50 fireballs. So, I'm gonna have to be real careful not to die down here. Where am I even going? North? I'm going north now. Northern Caravan. Lore. Um, at the Pike. Commander Cyrus. Yep. Pike needs reach. Is They just call it the Pike. Okay. Anything cool in here? Ooh, chest. Cool. Chain lightning. Big heal. Or a big, big mana push. Okay. Yep, fireball. We want to go north, right? Because this way... Not where we want to go. We want to go... Yeah, this is towards our goal. 200 meters away. Okay. So we might actually be going in the right direction. We might be going in the right direction anyway. Oh, tree. Big old tree. 
Big old trees. Um, can we avoid fighting that guy? Not anymore. Keep going. Oh, I should have made the uh, fire two charges, probably. This is another route. Probably not where I want to go. This guy, I had my shield, but it didn't matter. He's like, nope. No shields for you. Okay. Welp. Alright, let's try to get to my body. We're just gonna... Keep going north from here. See if I can hit these guys from really far away. I have a major advantage, but whenever they get close, I got nothing. What the heck? It takes so long to shoot. charge at you and then you're just like completely overwhelmed basically instantly all right so I'm still going this way right like means reach we're very close to the, the location that I've marked so it must actually be inside this shroud so it's I guess is a good thing that we came here that flower from far away. It's a level 15 flower. Uh, why is everything strong here? Oh, and we got a skilly guy. Skull bud. <laughs> yeah, that guy can go his own way. So, we're close. We're basically almost there. Uh oh. Are those guys in the ground? They're like glitched out as well. Good. Good. Be glitched out, please. Fine with me, I say. Okay. Oh, here we go. Ah, much better. Here, let me let me eat some uh some food too. Some berries. Well, oh, is that it? Is that Pike needs reach? Bandage too. Yep. Get some more health here. I think we're almost there. Uh oh, is this a big fortress? 
And I'm gonna have to like go through and kill everybody in. It certainly looks that way. So this is where we can find the the farmer's. What the heck is that? <laughs> the the kettle for the farmer. Cool, cool. But can we survive? Or am I just gonna get killed? I'm trying to reach this area here. Pike needs reach. Here we go. Can I? Oh, well, we got a uh, one of these respawn things, so that's good, I guess. That's good, I guess. Um, is there a bed? Nearby, because it's getting dark. Is there a person in there? Just hanging out. bed. Hmm. I sense a lot of guys here that are gonna try and kill me. A bunch of these uh, shroud guys, I'll betcha. Ooh, treasure chest. What do you got? Copper arrows. Might be a good idea to use some better arrows. Even though I have magic. Um, what's behind this door? I wanna find a bed. That's just wood. Just wood. Fireball? I only got 30 fireballs left. So we need to conserve shanty shacks. Okay. Get some shanty shacks. Uh oh. Don't like any of this. I was in here. I came out here. Okay. Shanty shacks. There's a guy up there. I know it. Saw a guy up here. And he's gonna try and murder me. Can I get to him before he gets to me? Nope. Got him. Okay. He still got me though. <laughs> Pretty good. Every time we face one enemy, we have to stop, heal, eat, drink. Just in an effort to not die. Ow! Fifteen. Ah! No! Okay with this. Not at all. I shot that guy like four times. Come on. Die already. And I still need a bed.
This guy. This guy. These guys are level 15. I don't like it. Will you come here so I can kill you? Is he running away so he can lead me somewhere? Yes. Whatever it is I'm killing, I want it to die. Getting dark. Ah. Help me, Skull Bud. Skull Bud. Get him. Get him. Oh, treasure. Flask of the Fell. I will use that. And uh, the other one. Yeah, some lighting. Skull bud. Multiple skull buds. Yes. Scared me. I would like a better wand. You know. Wand and shield combo probably is the best bet. Oh man, I'm getting low on my uh, shroud though. Might want to leave here and uh, reset. Leveled up. Ah.
Yeah, I need to go. I gotta get out of here. Cause I'm about to die. Back my uh, shroud protection here. Okay. Um, let's get some more shroud protection and eat some more food, probably. I can go up and over here, right? So basically, we're going where? There? Shroud root? There's a root shroud root here too, as as well. I should probably take out that shroud root, huh? Before I try to get the um the kettle. I wish I had a, an anvil I could repair my stuff in. Another uh, light thingy? Uh, leave that. Wisp light. More uh, lore. Let's on the floor. Okay. They're making an elixir here. And that's, um... That resets your time. But I don't need to. Okay. Wolf's Ma. Whoa, a new sword. Um. Give me that sword. 32 sword, eh? Mysterious flask. Is that the shroud root right there? That's the shroud root right there. Can I kill it without being killed myself? Shield works. Okay. This guy. This guy? I'm 
And there's a guy upstairs. Get him, Skull Bud. I like. Oh boy. We got a bunch of guys coming. Okay, how many guys are here? I'm out of fire, huh? How about lightning? What well, lightning does them? Lightning does them. Perhaps not as well as effectively. Anybody else down here? Anybody else want some death? Oh, there's another guy. What the heck? Got you, you jerk. Okay, let's get rid of this shroud root. Get him. Does magic work on these things at all, or what? Or do I just bash it? Should I just bash this thing? It's taking a long time. But I got it. Well, is this area now... less prone to, uh... Have those shrouded guys in it? What? Okay. Janty shacks. Imperial Gardens. Okay. Oh, what's this? Uh, let's get rid of something else. I have one spot free. Bug. Bug bed. Bug bad. Okay. What's in this one? Misfortune Mace of 48 Misfortune Mace, okay. Uh, Fireball 2. Um. Oh. <laughs> that surprises me every time these guys show up. So where is, um... Ooh, I blew a hole in that wall. Interesting. Anything in here? Nah. 
I guess not. So where's the kettle at? So I got the shroud root. Kettle. Kettle is over there. Yes. I uh, hear something. Was there an enemy? Whoa. What is that? Um, I guess we'll eat. And drink. Berry. Okay. Cool, cool. A sanctum thing. Ah, uh, here's the the kettle. Veiled in holy light. Raul, okay. Seven caravans, less perilous than ours. Okay. Yep. Cool, cool. Sorry about your bad luck. Oh, another uh, flame thingy as well. What the heck was that? That was a very strange sound. <laughs> it sounded like it, it exploded. <gasps> okay, we got the kettle. <laughs> strange, alrighty then. Oh man, we got so much stuff. More wisp plates. Those are always good to have. What is this? Some sort of uh, alchemist thing? Uh, we don't need cloth, man. Glow dust. That's right. More salt. All right, um, is there anything else in this location? We got the Flame Sanctum, we got the Pike Needs Reach. What's this? The Pike. Should I proceed on to the Pike? There's so many bugs. So that way is the Pike. Can't go that way from inside of here. Ooh. Great mana potion. That's pretty great. I wish we had a bigger backpack. Definitely want to get over there somehow. Um, can't really go through there. Anything here? Fireball 2! Might want to take that. Uh, again, I'll just get rid of some nails. Got some Fireball 2 charges. Well, let's go up. I do want to go this way, right? Got more purple berries. Another uh, shrine thing. Flame Shrine. Ooh. More sparks. There we go. <laughs> it didn't make a loud noise this time. A very strange noise, too. Uh, there's another pot here. 
Is it, wait, there's another pot here? Can I get two pots? What's going on there? Uh, we got too much of this meat. Oh, shroud liquid. What the? Um, how do I get up? Cause I can, I can warp back, but how do I get to the, the pike? Is there any reason why I would want to? I don't know. Aerial gardens. I don't want to, like, come all this way and then have to, like, come back later, though. You know? If I can get there, I want to get there. I don't know if I can. Well, we got red. Red stuff. Floor is lava. Maybe I should not be here. Flame Sanctum. Okay. Oh, treasure chest. Fireball two. Um, can I? Am I supposed to be here, Pike's Port? Can I get up there? Uh, almost. Made it. Well, do I want to be here or not? I don't think I want to be right here. It seems like a little... Okay, I can make it up there. Okay, I'm up here. We're up here. What's here, though? What is here? Can we open this? This gate? Imperial Gardens. I guess I'll take the lockpick. There didn't seem to be any enemies in this section, so that's good. Oh. Okay. I don't know if I can raise that gate. Hmm. Okay, well, is there a, uh, an anvil or what? Ooh, a note. Here we go. King Gormander's latest addition to Pike Mead's Reach is, in my opinion, a disgrace. Okay, sure, sure. Statue's gaze. Okay. He's the editor. <laughs> it's just... Imperial Gardens. Whoa. Is this the thing? Bandage in water. The gaze. <laughs> Is that a disgrace? This statue? Oh. Bugs down here. Don't like that. Okay. Okay. It's a lot of climbable things around here. And I'm not sure if I want to go on any of them. For any particular reason. Other than that they're there. I can't go through that door. It's blocked. Um, what about up here? Can we go over here? 
And everybody's dead, of course. The pike. We're at the pike. Why am I at the pike? I don't know. But we're here. Reach the capital. Pike means reach. Um. Ah, we get this thing. We need defeat the castle beast. Okay. Because we need this to upgrade our flame. So we need to defeat the enemy at the the top of the pike. And then we can get that uh that reward. Ooh, chest. Prayer of the Flame Scroll. What is that? 20% magic damage plus one time in the shroud for 30 minutes. Okay. Sure. A uh, temporary buff. Imperial Gardens. Is that where the boss, the mini boss of this area is? Okay. So there's a respawn thing here. Copper arrows. Okay. Definitely um, a mini boss in this area. Should I defeat this mini boss? Because we're already here. So I was like, I kind of think I probably should do that so that I can upgrade my. Um, Yeah. I can upgrade my thing. Oh, hello. Uh oh. That's not good. What have I gotten myself into? Uh oh. He resists the fire. He resisted the ice as well. doing here oh we are not doing any damage to this guy at all this was a bad idea can I get out of here can I leave here no I can't leave here uh oh uh oh how do I leave here this is a bad idea um 
This guy is super duper strong and he doesn't seem to be dying. Like at all. Master of the Bugs. I'm so dead. I'm so dead, man. He keeps summoning more bugs. No, I'm dead now. Okay. I did like no damage to that guy. Okay. Well, how was I supposed to know that he's just like super duper strong and he can't be killed? How was I supposed to know that? Can you get up from underneath this? Look at all that loot I want. All right, well, Welp, don't go there. I'm not being attacked, so I can just leave. That's fine. Oh, I can't because I'm in the shroud. Uh-oh. I'm in the shroud. Oh. Uh, is this fine? Is this okay? Cool. I'm not in the shroud right there. Good. Good. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Fix my stuff. Excellent. I'm um, going to Pike Mead's Reach. Uh, so that's one of the quests that we got from the blacksmith. So what does he have to say? What needs fixing? Tall tales. Oh. You know, I grew up in the capital. They used to tell stories. Stories I shared with my daughter as well. 
Sometimes at night, there's a faint light glowing beneath the waves. A sign of Queen Pikeney's gracious rule. My daughter said that she saw them at once. Children's tales, I thought, but who knows? Stranger things have happened in Embervale. New lore. Tales of Yonder. Oh, sure. Never let the coast die. Yep. And then... The farmer, we got your kettle. Kettle found. Praise the ancients, you got my kettle. How is Raoul? Oh, I got an. I saw a note from Raoul. Their time ran out as mine stood still. So we really are the last. How cold. Let's light a fire in their honor. Crafting a fireplace with that kettle will warm us right up. Sure. Cool, cool. Goodbye. I need to make a kettle. So yeah, to to upgrade this to strengthen my my flame. I need both goo, more sparks, and this guy fell wisp with fell wisp wyvern head. And to get that, I need to defeat that giant enemy, which I mean is it seems possible doesn't feel like insurmountable but it's definitely not something i can do right now uh, i'm gonna need way stronger spells i'm gonna need more food uh, way more healing because i used a lot of it and we got a new sword a 32 sword maybe we should try 43, 48. Maybe we should try um, hand to hand combat once more. Okay. What do we need to make the fireplace? We've got everything that we need. Craft it. Don't overwork yourself. And then. What'd you say? And then. We can't build this indoors, can we? Can we make it right next to you? <laughs> I will keep this kettle safe. I guess we can just make it indoors. Why not? <laughs> Grilled game. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, so we don't need a fireplace anymore. Roasted corn cob. What does that do? All right, well, we can now make popcorn. And that'll give us stamina recharge for seven minutes. Vegetable puree will give us dexterity for 35 minutes. Um. Okay, you've got another thing to say. A strange, a strange letter. What do you have to say? Flameborn, some time ago, a curious thing happened. I received a note. Take a look. From Reagan, courtesy of the Conways. But I've never met a Reagan. But I always know the Conways. Couriers from the east. They must have traveled through the trade outpost, Blazing Rock, to deliver this message. Can you investigate? Okay. So, trading outpost. Sure. Strike while the iron's hot. Cool. And now you've got a thing. Look what I have to offer. You need masonry tools. Okay. Oh. Wanna hear a joke? Carpenter without masonry tools. That's it. That's the joke. I'm a farce, a poser. I need proper tools, but the blacksmith won't lend me his. Go figure. I know where to get some masonry tools though. Does the research site at Pillars of Creation ring a bell? No. I can make stone fences. Okay. If I get masonry tools. Cool. Happy to help. We've got all kinds of new things. I can cook up some game. I was hoping for like meals. This is all just stuff that you can cook on like a a, a campfire. 
So I can just drop that stuff in there. And then in uh, an hour, we'll have 20 grilled game. I mean, sure, but that's not exactly what I need. So here, I'm gonna do one thing. I'm going to make some bug dust because uh, you need to make bug dust and then we'll, we'll have access to goo. So now we can make goo. I'll make one of those and now we can make shroud arrows with the hunter. Okay. So let's see. Enhance my wolf's maw. Get 34. And then I'm gonna take all of the adventurer stuff. Put it back on. And we're gonna try hand-to-hand uh, -hand combat one more time because man, <laughs> being a mage is difficult. So we're gonna call it here for today. In this episode, we went to Pike Mead's Reach, um, a fortress up to the northeast, and we got the kettle for the farmer. Um, that allows us to cook indoors. So that's pretty cool. We have a just a fire on our wooden floor and no one seems to mind. Instead of sitting down at a campfire every time, we can just cook here. Well, of course, it takes a lot longer to cook anything at the kettle, but we can also make that uh, popcorn <laughs> that we were seeing before and have some extra stamina food. But we don't have a whole lot of other food ingredients, which is disappointing. I was hoping we'd have like hearty meals that will like increase our health by a lot. But instead, all we can make is like a, a vegetable soup and a um, like game roast, which which is exactly the same as what we can make at a campfire. So a little disappointing after going through all that effort that we were not able to uh, get any better meals. But perhaps that's something we can unlock in the future. I also got a better sword. It's a level 15 sword and it does 34 damage now because I upgraded it. Um, so perhaps we will have better luck with hand-to-hand -hand combat now. I did level up because I defeated a a shroud root and that got me, that got my level higher. So we could potentially do some more hand-to-hand -hand skills that might help me out in, in combat, but we'll see. So if you would like to follow along with our adventure and see if we are able to get good at hand-to-hand -hand combat, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. If you'd like to make a comment down below or hit the like button, that would be appreciated as well. So until next time, thanks for watching.